Good afternoon and a beautiful afternoon it is indeed. Um, today I am touring 9244 West Denton in beautiful Glendale, Arizona. Uh, this is located right off of the main streets of 91st Avenue and um, Camelback Road. Sorry, <laughs> a little slow there. Um, what's wonderful about this community is all of the lots in this community are quarter acre lots and it's only limited to two streets of homes. And I don't know if you caught that about the crossroads, but 91st Street and Camelback, you literally could walk to Westgate um, or Cardinal Stadium, um, yet, you, yet you have the closeness, quiet, um, and a skip and a jump to the 101. Um, behind, this, behind this community, behind Crystal Cove Estates, are one acre lots with uh, irrigation. So it's just really nice. Everybody's uh, spaced out. It's like you're in the country. Now I'm going to make one little quick spin here just to show you the, the pavers here are extended on the driveway. So this way uh, it makes it easier access to the RV gate um, and also just additional parking if desired. There's additional pavers of course to the front door. So this first front room is going to be the den. Uh, the, house, the house itself is a four bedroom, three bath, plus a den. Um, out of those four bedrooms, we're going to see the first bedroom, um, which is the, the front bedroom that is en suite. It is perfect for an on, uh, like an in-law or a flex purpose. Um, this house does come with a ring system, both in the front and the back, and that does convey. Okay, so I'm just walking into the front foyer. You can see the ceiling heights um, throughout, they actually st <laughs> they start at this height, which is uh, right at right about nine foot, and then they jump up even higher to ten foot in the great room. Um, I need to close the door and show you her coming in. So straight up, ahead, straight ahead is the great room, living room. As we turn here, this is the bonus room. This room is utilized currently as an office space. It could be a game room, it could be a second living room, um, which would really flow quite nicely because as I stated, as I was walking into the entrance about the flex uh, capabilities of this floor plan, um, here's your front door, here's the office, or you could use as a living room, uh, bonus room. Um, here is the ensuite bedroom. So this bedroom uh, also faces the front of the home. And uh, that's what the hall we came out of, or the foyer. Here's the uh, full bathroom with a shower tub combo. And you'll notice throughout that they've got very, very nicely um, updated fixtures, both in the plumbing and electric. I just wanted to kind of show you the closet. <laughs> So the, the house runs on three zones for maximum energy efficiency. This is a DR Horton home. Uh, they are known for that. They're very, very big on green energy. Um, so the first zone will control the front portion of this home. So it's basically gonna control this next gen. Let's just call it next gen for the sake of <laughs> calling it something, um, would be controlled here. Um, now, here's our foyer. So we're, we're, let me just get our bearings again. We're at the front door. Okay, we've already seen the, office we've seen the bedroom with the net with the ensuite coming straight in and this is one of my favorite parts about this particular floor plan is all of this space it's just a massive area um, and this is a, a formal dining with a little butler's pantry that leads into the kitchen okay so we're just going to keep on moving. I'm going to take you into the great room. And here you see where, where it steps up. So right now, right now where I'm standing, I'm at nine foot, which is way, still way up there. <laughs> but beyond that, it's a it's a 10 foot beyond that where the where the great room living room is. Here is your kitchen, full slab granite. Um, uh, stainless steel appliances, gas cooktop, gas oven. Uh, there's also a wine cooler back there, hiding back there. 
I'm not sure if the wine cooler conveys, but there's definitely space for that. Um, here is your great room. You'll notice that is a four panel multi-slide door. Here's the pantry. And this is the hall that leads to the to two more bedrooms and the um, as well as the laundry area. So here is the pantry off of the kitchen. I'll give you kind of an idea. There's definitely ample space for storage in there. We're going to come back out. There's your living room entrance. Here's our hallway. So we'll just go ahead and go down here and take a look. Look at how wide these hallways are. They're just it's just nice and spacious. So if you've got somebody that's tall. This house is great for that. Um, so immediate right is going to be the um, guest bath. This bath also serves the other two bedrooms. So now we've already seen the first bedroom up front and the den, which we don't count as a bedroom, but that could for all intents and purposes be used as one. Um, here's bedroom two and here's bedroom three. Now bedroom two is a you know be bedroom en suite. Right now we've got storage in there. <laughs> but this bedroom is currently being used as a gym. So it's, it's a pretty, pretty obvious that this, these rooms have space, um, but there's no, no lack for, for size or space. Um, this room is an exact sister or duplicate of the house of the bedroom that's on the other side. There's a little window here. I'm going to do one spin. Okay. So here, I mean, this is a full-size treadmill. <laughs> the, the rooms are conservatively, they're just, they're just really good size. So nobody is going to be shorted here in the bedrooms. Okay, so again, that's the sister room. So that's, this is bedroom two and three. Okay, now we're going to head back up the hallway, kitchen, of course. Here's the bathroom that we just popped into. This laundry room is absolutely fabulous. You're going to love this. Um, there's ample room in this laundry room to have not one, but two sets of washers and dryers if you'd like it. Or perhaps you would like to have a, a, a refrigerator-freezer combo. Um, you have room. It really makes it wonderful. Um, the garage is, is extended length. Um, I just don't know if there's if they are storing in there right now. But it's a, it's a two two car garage extended width with a little bit extra length. Okay, we're gonna go back out to the great room. And last but not least, I'm going to show you the master retreat. And then behind that, I'm going to show you the fantastic rear grounds. All landscaping is complete and in. Um, you just come on in, everything's ready to go. Okay, so here is yet another a little, little arch Little, or a little, little niche foyer. And here's the master retreat. Again, you've got that, got, you have the nine, nine, nine to 10 foot ceiling height. This is a very generous room. And who doesn't love a shower with generous space? This is a, a Snail shower, so you just come in, and there you go. There's even a super cool little linen linen shelves. Here's the, the toilet room. Um, and take a look, <laughs> get a load of this closet. The closet's just fabulous. It's big. So to finish off the tour for this house, I'm going to show you the rear grounds. The wonderful thing about the rear grounds is behind it are um, one, our one acre home site. So ironically, Crystal Cove, again, it's only made up of two streets of, of homes, are one quarter acre lots. They're the smallest lot sizes in this block vicinity. <laughs> Everything else surrounding us has huge, huge, uh, huge parcel sizes. So this is where you get that country feeling and you literally could walk to the walk to the game, go to the Cardinals game or go to Westgate and watch hockey. We've got uh, the two wonderful arenas just waiting for you. This is the back ground, backyard, excuse me. 
I'm gonna just pop out. Got a little grassy area for the puppies or kids. So, um, let's see if I can switch arms <laughs> without making you too dizzy. I'm walking along the back of the yard right now. What I want to show you contact bash. Here's the back side of the yard facing towards the front where the RV gate is. And we're just going to do a twirl. So again, just to give you an idea, the sheer size of the yard, you definitely have space between your neighbors. It's just a wonderful house and a very rare find indeed. Um, thank you so much for watching today, and if you have any interest, please schedule a showing with us.